constructing the centroid of a triangle. Now, the centroid of a triangle is the intersection of the three medians of your triangle. So, the first thing that we need to do is to create a median. To do that, you need to find a midpoint of each side, the midpoint of each side. So, take your compass, extend the length to be greater than half of the length of your side, and draw an arc. Now, using that same radius length, come to the other side of the other end point of this side and cut another arc. Now you'll see the two points of intersection. And connect those. There's your first midpoint. Now, let's go ahead and create the midpoint to this side by using the same process. It needs to be greater than half the length of the side. Mark an arc using the same radius length. Go to the other end point of the side to this vertex. And see the points of intersection? Connect those. And there's your second midpoint right there. Now continue to the third side and create a midpoint there as well. Cut an arc using the same radius. Come to the other end point of that side. Cut another arc. Connect those two points. And there's our third midpoint. Now let's create our medians. So we need to go from the vertex to the midpoint of the opposite side. There's the first one. There's the second one. Here's the third one. And that point of concurrency, or the point of intersection, of those medians is called the centroid. Now, if I did a good job at this centroid, I should be able to cut out my triangle and balance my triangle on this point with a pencil. Because a centroid is also the center of gravity of a triangle. Now, who knows if I did a good enough job, but I'm going to try it. Hmm, you should probably try for a sharp pencil if you can find one. All right, let's see how we did. Not bad, not bad. I would have to say we're balancing. So that's how you create the centroid of a triangle.